So if you've got an image on the page and the link window indicates that the PPI, the resolution is not high enough for what you want it for, what do you do? Well, you resize it. And this image is an effective PPI of 237. And uh, the actual PPI is 300, but that's kind of irrelevant here. The effective PPI is what really matters. And that's not high enough for print. Now, there's a couple of ways of resizing it. First of all, look up here on the control bar, and these fields say 100% in each, and there's a link icon next to them. Now, if I double-click on this image, which means now I've got the image selected, Look what happened to that nice, neat 100% number. It's become 126.7429. Great. So it's giving me four decimal points of whatever this is. This is actually the percentage of the original size that the image has been enlarged to. And if I took that back down so that this read 100, this would read 300. So let's give that a try. I'll highlight this number, and I'll type in 100. I'd better delete the rest of it. There we go, 100. Now I'm going to click the link icon, and look what happened. The image resized, but the frame didn't. And now in the links window, it says the effective PPI is indeed 300. And if that was now OK, I could go Object, Fitting, fit frame to content and that brings the frame down to the image and that is now a 300 dpi image i'm going to undo that a second the other way of dealing with it is if i'm not trying to get back to exactly 300 i'm just resizing it to what i want it to fit and then if I've got the frame selected, so in both these fields it reads 100% and the link icon's are on. So if I want to size that down to say 85, and I'll click on the link icon, and it sized it in both dimensions at once. I have to be careful next time because now that's unlinked. And the effective PPI went up some to 278. Do you know, at around 280 I stopped worrying about it. It's not quite 300, but it's pretty good, and I doubt if it's really going to matter. So at about 280, I tend to think, good enough. So I'm almost there. If I size that down again, and notice how both these windows read 100%, because as soon as you resize it, this is now 100%. It's not talking about what it used to be. If I double-click on the image, now that's talking about what it used to be, but as far as the frame's concerned, whatever size it is, is 100%. Now I'm going to click on the link icon again and put in 95 and click on that. 293. So now I'm over my level of concern, and that would be fine. I could put that where I want and print it. 